you know, welcome back to Two Toys Play 75. Welcome back to the, to the toy box where happiness is mandatory. It's squeaked. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, welcome to the uh, whatever episode we're on of Shin Megami Tensei 5, the sequel. It's teen. We're up to the, oh, the, big, the big teen. Like, oh God. Ah, the big ten. Ah, yes, so oh this God. one's going to be called Shin Megami Tensei. No, no, it's not. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm just being silly, don't mind me. <laughs> but wow, yeah. we're, up to, we're up to double digits now, isn't that amazing? Yeah, isn't it great? We're finally... Jeez, I can't believe we've gone this far, that's actually episode 10, that's wild. It is pretty wild, but then again, this is like a bit of a long game, especially because we get lost <laughs> frequently, and we have no idea we're, what we're doing live on stream! Yay! Yeah, so we did, we did the things off screen, uh, where were we? We were here, weren't we? We were down on this bridge here. To clear out this thing, got up to this point, and of course, there's another, another abscess that wants to be dealt with, of course it, of course it is. Uh, if it's, you know, if it's not one, it's another. But yeah, we <laughs> we basically wrapped up, I believe. If memory, if memory is not gonna fail me here, uh, we beat up the the one guy with the sword, who was just like, yeah. you know, how dare you be serving like <laughs> Bethel? I believe it was. Yeah. And it was just like, uh, you know, just be we're very misunderstood because everyone just thinks we're bad. Maybe. Yeah, he was very much like, how do you serve them? I'm gonna beat you up like some sort of cop and we were like no you and beat him up instead and then, that was it yeah he's just like oh I, I see you have much power and then hecked right off so <laughs> 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 it's about right there are a couple of things we need to sh try and show somehow because they happened off screen it was like ah cutscenes happened we need to show this somehow so let's see if we can switch to that and show that without any problems Oh, Amanazako is back. After like how long? It's been a while. Well, well, certainly. Again, huh? <laughs> this has like totally got to be destiny or whatever, right? <laughs> got to be, unless you don't believe in that sort of stuff. Either way, perfect timing. We got business, you and I. Or actually, I guess I just kind of need your help. You see, there's this big hole. Oh. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, never mind. Forget I said anything. You're probably kind of busy anyway, <laughs> right? I just remembered I've got something important to do. Catch you later. Bye bye. And she just hicks off. That's like where Tsubasa like just raises a brow at that comment. Like, um, what? <laughs> hmm, not here. But what is not here, I wonder. I'm here! Finally, yeah. We can get like, we, we've done like Huapo's thing. I'm here! Silky's essence. Hmm. It, it was it. And, and then that happened, yep. <laughs> so yes, we got all that done off screen. Indeed. Also, apparently it's just not like loading for me, so let me just like try to disconnect and reconnect quickly, see if it works for me. Yeah. It's just, you know, Discord being Discord. Yes! We have visual and audio. We have visual and audible, yes. Not, not that audible, though. Not like we're gonna... <laughs> And now, this is a perfect segue to our sponsor, Audible. No, I'm kidding. No, absolutely <laughs> not. No. We're not sponsored by Audible, or affiliated in any way. The only sponsors we're going to ever have are sponsors of toyification technology, when it happens. Yes, yes, oh my gosh. And even if they don't sponsor us, we're going to sponsor them anyway. I would. Happily would do so. <laughs> yes, yes. I don't know what we would call it, but, you know, it'll, it'll be like... 
this has been sponsored by uh, insert the technology that makes everyone into a toy. It's like, here you go. It's just, it, it just works. It's beautiful. Yeah, we've used a few new uh, things. Oh, Yoshitsune. <laughs> yes, it begins in Hasotobi. Oh, beautiful. Always lands crits too. Oh, that is disgusting and amazing. It's beautiful. It's just so I, glorious. I imagine. It might not be as broken as in other games, but... It's probably still amazing, though. It's been pretty great, regardless. <laughs> I mean, it's Hasotobi. It's it's tended to be a very good performer. Ironically, there was one side quest with an enemy that blocked physical, so I was like, oh, okay, uh, well... Mm. That's its only counter, <laughs> really, is if it can't hurt, so... It was what this was for. Yeah, that was helpful for that. And retaliates like a stronger counter. Makes sense. So this is like this game's version of Counter Strike or whatever it's called. Low MP recovery when you strike a weakness or land a critical, so like... Which with Hasotobi <laughs> is guaranteed, so... But yeah. Yeah, it's only Great. Good. Guaranteed to carry us through the rest of the game. Well, maybe. I'd say the only one that could really dethrone Yoshitsune would be something like Siegfried, if it's as like devastating as we've, as our personal experience has been with it at times. Yeah, so I've got a good new lineup here. What next? Uh, oh, Magatsuri Wellspring. All allies recover HP and MP if Magatsuri is full at the start of the turn. It doesn't recover Ooh. too much, but given how little we actually use Magatsuri, it's actually kind of useful. It is, isn't it? It's almost like having like a free passive of like, what was the really low tier like passive for HP and MP recovery? It's probably like that, right? Uh, what was it called? I don't recall, but it heals about 15 HP, 5 MP each. So it's about. Each phase, yeah. so. Not a lot, but helps. It helps when you're over like, time. just randomly fighting enemies and you get it free for free at the start of each battle. True. I finally, finally found a fire gem. Finally, we just, awesome! We just decided, screw it, I'm going to look up a guide and found where they usually spawn, which was the previous area. Oh. It just to be an absolute but well. after I f f finally found another fire gem, I found another one in the main area we're currently in anyway. Just oh. after, after the quest was completed. Wow. Troll. Is that yeah. always how it is, though? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it was clearly just dumb luck, or it was only, maybe not only spawning in certain spots and we were investigating the wrong spots. Yeah, it really was just kind of like that, wasn't it? Like, it just turns out we were just not in the right area. There we yeah. go. There's currently a quest to fight Horus. So we're going to do that. Oh, yes, I see a me man. Oh, I do. A very, like, low frame rate Mimon. Yes, they do. It's just, as they do. They're just sad uh, there. Being how, low frames. How do we get to that? Oh, hello. <laughs> no. And now we fight that glowy burp. Wind and darkness. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, yep. It's, it's very good. And you can imagine what's going to happen when I do this. Oh, oh, oh. oh, yes. Doing Donum Gladi on Yoshitsune. We gotta see the big numbers now. No. I don't know if it would do fire, but we could probably assume one or the other. Here. At least light is more threatening than fire as a whole, because it can one shot, so. Yeah. Just a nice gremlin laugh. <laughs> <laughs> 
before <laughs> before ultimate demise. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, don't worry, Alice. They will die for you. Asotobi! <laughs> it's basically like 900 damage. Pretty much. Alright. Time for another big burst. Oh, no, we're fine. Yeah, between Alice and Yoshitsune, they're just tearing into us. Crazy. Oh my <laughs> goodness. Almost like finish it off too. Uh, glorious. Isn't it glorious? I love it. Oh, uh, Hasso Toby, how we've missed you. Destroyed. Hecking destroyed. Oh my goodness, yeah. Well that was like pretty much GG easy, so <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's so nice just the embodiment of... Uh, what do you call it? Uh, uh, the, the embodiment when, of... Hmm. When you can just be lazy and negligent. Ah, uh, yes, that. It does. Like, the, the, the embodiment of making it so easy you can just throw things in it, because who cares? When you don't feel like being strategic, uh, the embodiment of, let's go with, uh, effortlessness, sure. Some, something like that. I, I can't remember what the word is. The thing that really carries Saren up, though, is not so much the stats, though it, you know, stats of course help, but it's really more the utility. Yeah. Like, Saren up is just so good at what it does, and uniquely does, that... It's just, it's such a good party member. Like, we yeah. really probably will have Siren up the entire run. Siren up was part of the fusion for Yoshitsune, so I had to, like, you know, make I'll a, get new, a one. new one. But it's why Yoshitsune also has Dorum Gladi. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. Yep. It's what you wanted, uh, I presume. Got some XP, we got a talisman. And just like that, just as mysteriously as she arrived, she vanished. <laughs> it's just, it do be like that. Gosh, it's gonna annoy me forever. Um, we're gonna have to look it up. <laughs> it's going back to. Let's see, so it was. Plot. So similar words for, are like easy and like low effort in that, right? Like laziness? Yeah, easy, low effort, lazy. Uh, word, as, as we've established, word. words are hard. Words are very hard. I agree with that. <laughs> I like how searching effortless and thesaurus gave me duck soup as one of the synonyms. I'm like, uh, what? Du du duck soup? Duck soup. What does that mean? Well, it means like, you know, things similar to a breeze, a snap, cakewalk, ch cherry pie. There's a lot of food related things for easy, isn't there? Complacent. Complacent. That's what that's, it was. Okay. That's what the word was we were looking for was. We remember it's a, it's a trope on TV tropes somewhere, so we were searching everywhere for whether TV tropes mentioned Hasatobi being complacent or complacent gaming. And we were searching around, we found Game Breaker, and we were hoping to find somewhere in there the the trope, whatever it was called. And we were just searching, looking through the page, and randomly the bra our brain spawned the word complacent. Because it just takes its time to cycle through everything, and eventually it works out. There's the word, got it. You happy now? Yay, we did it! <laughs> I'm happy. We did it. Okay, yes, that's the. That. The word complacent. How's that how we encourages we did it. encourages being complacent because it makes things a cakewalk. Oh, cutscene time. Right. 
He would probably just say, I'm a Nahobino. I don't know if he... Well, would he say that I'm with Bethel? Hmm. That's a simple answer, but at the same time, it depends on... Because hmm. it's like, there's two definitely different answers we can say. We can just describe, like, what we are, or just say who we're basically working for, I maybe, suppose. Maybe this is almost sort of a weird Japanese thing, because it feels... It feels strange to answer with what you are than what your affiliation is. Yeah. No, it's, it does come off as rather, like, odd, in a sense. It doesn't grammatically flow. Yeah, it just it just comes off as, like, a, a little unusual, we'll say. Like, to what we're typically exposed to. Because, yeah, like you said, uh, it would be odd to basically have the equivalent of, like, Hello, my name is X, and you are. And it's saying, like, I'm an X rather than saying, like, yeah. what your name yeah. is. And it's just like, that would just seem really random, like, you know, to what we're accustomed to. I mean, that makes sense. If you were, if you were to say that you are with Bethel... Why are you here? I'm doing a thing for Bethel. <laughs> just makes sense, really. I mean, yeah. Not wrong. I gotta <laughs> say. Off, maybe? <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps. In before, Subasa is really just a chess master and is using everyone around him for for their own ends. Mm, I mean, we could have him progress yep. that direction. Could. Where he's like, I'm gonna use this weird powers in the situation to my own ends. Tear down the system. He Etc. Cetera, Etc. Cetera. Yeah, exactly. Like he sees like how flawed <laughs> both sides are, and he decides to do option the third, what he wants to do instead. <laughs> oh, an Akia Gungan. We did the thing. We did the thing. Yes, pass. That's the idea. We're going to assert no, no, our dominance against the Sir. Powerful presence from beyond the flames. I advise that we ready ourselves before moving on. Oh, goody. I guess Yay. we should. Uh, Something tells me the game is subtly, or not so subtly, hinting that this is a big scary boss, you might want to be ready for it. Hmm. Well, let's see how we do, right? What has allowed you to come this far? Few have ever withstood my heat with such calm. Fight for better as much as you please. It doesn't change the fact that God is dead. The end of this world is long overdue. With my flames, I cert shall cremate it all. Do not dare Things are really heating up. Stop me. I shall reduce you to ash, along with everything else! With tempers flared, we fight. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Okay. Right, so now that I've destroyed us all with my bad puns, now we get to do a fight. 
So let's see what we're up against here. We have yeah, big ice. surprise. It drains fire, but it is weak to ice. Got a lot of strength though. Yeah, you. That's a bit terrifying. A lot of magic as well. So this is going to be a very hard hitting boss, regardless of what it uses. It's not much, but it's Kapula. It'll do. That's not cool. Hmm. Now we're playing with real damage numbers here. <laughs> well. That <laughs> Oh goodness, that was a bit scary. <laughs> Poor Yoshitsune though. Please, please keep using fire attacks on, on Subasa. I agree. This is fine. Maybe just heal some in peace. Just do it. Yeah, I think that's probably what the best we can do. Hmm. Let's try it. I'll keep cautious, cheer up. Yeah. You stop there. Oh boy. This is gonna get spicy. Well, you should see barely good enough in pay for the next Hassel Toby. Barely, yeah. Which, depending on how this goes, might be its only time it gets to before it gets annihilated again. Some good damage. <laughs> so much damage. Uh, Hasotopi is just so good, isn't it? Oh, destroyed. Yes. So, you know, I, I think we can all agree that Hasotobi kind of carried that fight between the ice attacks. Because <laughs> it was doing like probably eight to 900 damage every time when set up. Yeah. Hallelujah. So it was a lot. Hmm. Hellfire Highway. Twenty thousand. And twenty thousand Maka too. Easy. Oh, Tyrant Cert has been unlocked for fusion. Yeah, what do you want? Oh. Uh, 
Tactical. That's a thing. I'm sure we won't regret it. Regret it. <laughs> we'll see. Um, you didn't watch clearly. It was. It was. Yeah, you didn't see us just literally destroy a giant like fire monster, right? Yeah, it was like, oh no, Bethel's destroyed suit. You better be careful, or I'll destroy you too. Technically correct, but you're missing the detail where it was us. Yeah, yeah. I feel like something got lost in translation there. Probably, probably the fire got in the way. Yeah. It was too much heat distortion. Couldn't tell what was happening. Well, I'll not uh, say no to that. We can... Hey, we got gems now! Oh my gosh. Them. That's actually pretty expensive. Maybe leave those for now. You know how it is in these games. Just when you're, you're just like, we have all this money, you the game goes, on. now you're not going to have all this money because look. And it's like, no! That was a pretty nice gremlin noise, <laughs> uh, as usual. Well, may maybe not quite gremlin. Maybe maybe more like I don't know, but it's a noise. You know how it is on this on the fleet's play, mouth noises and stuff. Mouth noises and flashing pixels everywhere. And and mouth pixels and flashing sounds. Absolutely. <laughs> Well, if you want to see some mouth pixels, there's a mouth moving. That counts as mouth pixels. I don't know. I don't even know. Where am I even going with that? I don't know. Oh no, not that thing. We don't want to fight that thing. Massive demon made of boulders. Yeah, that way, doesn't way back sound in pleasant. Like first, second, session, the big titany golemy thing. It was like level oh. 40 when we, were like, when we were like level 8. Oh dear. Yeah, that doesn't sound great. I suppose I'm do. Although, assuming it's still only level 40, that won't be bad because we can handle it. If it's higher level than that, though, uh, uh, well, hmm. Oh, can we actually go this way now? No, we can finally go this way. Huzzah! You yeah, know, there should be a Miman in here somewhere. The one Miman we missed in I... this area. Because it was behind the two Bozo angels who were like, you, you can't go this way, it's too dangerous. It's in stuff, and things, and reasons. Wait, isn't it? Isn't it our friend? I. maybe? Hmm. I wonder if I go here. We've been doing bad things. Still haven't found the. Uh oh. oh. We were still trying to find Miban. Can you please hold off on your plot, plot, doing, eventing, the, just the, for a moment? The plot-based death event. Oh, yes. My power. I, I'm losing control. I, ah, Be careful. Oh no. Monozako's on the verge of going berserk. This is where we discover that she I was the big rampaging demon. I can't hold it back. You. You. You have to take my power! Okay. Well, maybe I was correct a little bit, but... <laughs> 
here. Just kidding. Let's see you're up against here. Oh, golly. Thanks. So you want fire and ice. Quite the array of defenses. Yeah. Amano Sako, you've been holding out on us. Haha. <laughs> 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 yeah, we probably want to get some setup here. Unfortunately, she has our counter, so... Electric. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Ah, so Toby! Oh, oh. Ow. Oh no, that's, that's a bad sign. Oh, uh, Yoshi Tsune is weak to dark, that's... yeah. He's not Mudo. He's not Mudo. Please... Please do not the Mudo. Agree. Yeah, oh, okay. No, didn't. <laughs> I agree, do not. <laughs> Please keep doing that on Black Frost, and not anyone else. Agreed. It kind of makes Black Frost her per the perfect counter to her, because it's like... Her counter attack does nothing to Black Frost, while Black Frost also does physical, so it's quite nice. Yeah, that's what I'd like to see. Oh, absolutely. That's, that's not what I'd like to see, like though. That's <laughs> what we really don't like to see. We, don't, we really don't <laughs> like to see that either. <laughs> Freeze. Oh, I don't like to see that at all. Oh, this is all going Wait, bad. That's, that's pretty good. What's she likely to use, though? Could run the risk of him being obliterated by it. Because you know the rules, if Tsubasa dies, it's game over anyway. And we don't want to see what a massive electric attack on him looks like, probably. <laughs> right, let's see how bad this goes. Oh, good shit. Masanma. Oh. Surinup did not appreciate. Ow. Please no. We would, no, I said no. Stop. Cease. Oh my goodness, she could have actually just destroyed us that round, but decided not to attack Subasa a third time. Mm. Well, that was spicy. That was very spicy. Unfortunately, we chose poorly. Your turn. Go. Your turn to make choice. Hmm. True. Do not want. Sadness. Oh my god. More sadness. We're in danger. Just a little bit. Ah, <laughs> uh, God love 
Tentara Fu, right? This works. Well. <laughs> Jeez. My goodness. Oh my god. Marazako, can, can we not? Oh, well. rip. Complete TPK. It's... Yeah, wow. Whew. Maybe we will. Yeah, no. Per perfectly. Like, you, you saw. We, we pulled off the clutch at the end. Uh, of dying. Anyway. <laughs> so. <laughs> yeah, you're like, beware. Yeah, and we're like, well. Well, you're, it's our friend. What's going on? It's all fine. No problem here. Absolutely fine. This is fine. Yeah, I think Cotton Boom Boom is not something we wish to do anyway. I don't think she had a light skill, just to be really annoying. That would be rude. So, give, give, give weak light block dark a go? Weak Maybe? light? Yeah, I don't think anything's going to be light based currently. Maybe. That, uh, that golden apple would be pretty great if it wasn't hecking expensive. Seriously, right? It's a really good skill. It's like, it's one of those things where it's like, the high cost of it really demands that you use it at exactly the most optimal time. The problem is, is like, when is that most optimal time? Because you want to be in two situations. One of them is all of you and the rest of your active party are badly damaged, or at least pretty damaged, and also not buffed at all. And that's assuming you want to get the most absolute possible potential out okay, of it. Okay, I got Yoshitsune's Yasutobi down to 39 MP, which is better. But I it's agree. Better. When it's plus 9, I'm sure it would be nice and cheap, relatively speaking. Stop slacking on using those women. Buff items. It's worth the shot. Don't punch you again. All right, round two. Oh boy. Business is it going to try and use yeah. wind again, or is it going to change its mind? Hmm. That. That's a good question. Three thunder. Incredible. <laughs> Ow. Yeah. Just to be a troll, right? Hmm, do you think it's gonna be like force slash wind again? Game's like lol, no. Yeah, it was just unfortunate, really. Last coin toss twice in a row. Yes, please keep using it against I... against Black Frost because it does nothing. I I agree. Also, I just love that that attack is literally her just going like a a a a a like ah. Oh! <laughs> Solid damage. Oh, we're very close. It's good for it. If we want to agree, make it if we just steal. Oh, okay, let's see whether we can. Okay, 
Hustle Toby should be able to do this. There we go. There we go. Now that's style points. Well, that took a while, but we got it. Uh, my power... It's... Update. We have obtained a concentration of Amanazako's power. We can use it as an essence. Ooh, does that mean we can learn all those scary skills we had? Ooh, I hope so. Because that would be sweet. What? Where is this? Where... Where am I? What happened to me? You mean cooking? That <laughs> oh, saw a minor case of major bloodlust. My power and started losing it, right? Totally. Yes, you seem unfazed. Does it happen often? <laughs> uh, possibly. And you, you swooped in and saved me, didn't you? Seriously. He did. Didn't By you? punching you a punch? Sure. That's oh, oh, one oh. way to save and someone. You took my power, huh? Looks like you got a little something out of it at least. <laughs> Good thing. Ah, uh, you a, you're, you're a strange one. <sighs> Just I'm so a little. Tired. <laughs> well, I guess I'll see you around. Bye bye! What? No. You did. What? But, but you can't just. Hey. All that, and it's just like, hey, looks like you, like, stole a bit of my power and saved, like, stopped me from rampaging and saved me, so bye. He's just like, well, wow, you, you saved me. Okay, see you later. She's like, this is, why, this is why Tsubasa has trust issues. He goes out of his way to do a nice thing, to save a life, and they're just like, oh, that was really cool, thanks, bye. And it's like, what? Not even a, a thank you? Not even a, uh, like... I'm eternally grateful. Just bye. Okay. Yeah, since it's, you know, a counter. Was your burial? Was your burial? Severe electric attack to all foes. Ooh. So it's even stronger than and... Ageon. Or Ageon. Whatever you, whatever yeah. it is. It's... Oh my god, he's level 76. <laughs> and it has, well... The weird thing will be that we'll be weak to two common elements, but we'll be very resilient elsewhere. So yeah, she's clearly in the game stats with a strange array of elements like that. Yeah. Oh my god, she is thunder rain. Thunder rain. Oh, you're right. I saw that too. I was <laughs> like, whoa. What are, you, what are you, the daughter of Thor? Possibly. I mean, the answer to that is no, because I don't think Amano Zako is a Amano Zako. Does not sound like a Norse name, so. It's She's just unlikely to be the, literally the daughter of Thor, but you know, having Thunder Rain, it does. That's that's a pretty high tier thing. <laughs> so you're forty-eight, geez. Yep. So the this thing, which would have like utterly curb stomped us. When we were we were in this area, uh, now it's not so much. Because it's weak to fire, does ice damage, and it, it deals ice. Yeah, it's weak to mirage as well, but we don't really have a. Well, I think all we have actually all we have is certain for fire damage, which isn't great. Though, to be fair, we have been fighting a lot of things where fire has not been relevant lately, yes, so true. we kind of phased it out in our lineup.
There we go. I like to see that. <laughs> no crushing today on your part. I feel like, it. unfortunately, Black Cross doesn't have much use here against this thing. It's the thing it Ah, beautiful. It's like such a dramatic impact, and it's like not big damage at all, but... You know, it's cool though. Just a little bit of Mirage, that's all. <laughs> yeah. Excellent. Of a battle of making sure I can't hit you, if anything. Yeah. Like, it's not quite an attrition battle, it's really just more of like a mitigation battle, really. You don't want it to do what it does, because you'll probably not survive long, but as long as it doesn't get to do that, you're fine. Pow, that's nice. It, it is, if anything, extra insurance against the attack. You know, if it can actually hit, which thankfully it doesn't. <laughs> We're getting there. Hey, no, we can't be having that. Or that. Back to Mirage for you. Oh no. Or not. <laughs> no. That's gonna try and like be annoying and avoid getting Mirage or anything, and so it's like, oh no, oh no, oh no, it's gonna take, oh no. It's like, oh no. Yeah, basically, it's just, oh no. Likely to do. Uh... My guess is probably Crusher Onslaught. Although it does have Mabufadine. Well, here's the thing. It might be a coin toss between those two. The thing is, is we can mitigate one of them. We can't mitigate the other one. There we go. We could be able to... I would say for extra insurance, we could do an, like, like the ice item. But, like, yeah, I don't think we have any. Is there, like, a. We have physical yeah, damage, right? We can do either or. It's just me which one it's gonna use. Either or. It's gonna miss. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Not only did it miss everyone that it, it would have hurt, it hit the one that didn't hurt, couldn't hurt, rather. Yeah. That was very great RNG on our part. It's worth banking on here. Well, I think that gamble paid perfectly off there. If I was talking about ludicrous damage, I would do it. Kunitsu Keystone. Oh, that's the, the item yeah. we needed, right. Perfect. Got a Balm of Life for our troubles. And of course, XP. Is good.
Glad we could help. <laughs> Kunitsu, or, uh, yeah, that it is is a thing. You. Oh. You know, we're just doing this as we do. If you have a problem, the protagonist is the, is the is the way you fix it. Yeah, it sure was. It was very hot. I mean, that radiation looks unsafe, but hey, I think radiation generally tends to be, depending on the radiation, of course. But yeah. You really brought down that hothead, huh? Sheesh! Here's something else. I've gotten a lot better at fighting myself, but I'm nothing compared to you. <laughs> <laughs> so we can either be, like, overconfident or modest. Basically. Man, what do you think? it's gotta feel yeah. good to say something like that. Wish I had that kind of confidence. I don't think Subasa's actually... Sincerely confident. Well, at least he's not. Probably just puts on a front. I think what he does is probably still at least considers him above Ichiro. <laughs> yeah. <I gotta laughs> I say, see though, that. I'm sure glad I got these angels from Master Abdiel. Only because of her, I made it this far without getting killed. Actually, if we hadn't run into her back there, I probably would have been screwed. Maybe I can hold my own in a fight as it is. But it's not enough. I've got to know the limits of my power. Make the wrong call out here, and you're dead. Seriously, I really can't thank Master Abdiel enough. I actually met up with her again after we separated. She leads others without any hesitation at all. Feels like, if it's her call, I can go ahead without second-guessing myself. That reminds me. You know how Director Koshimizu always asks us what we want to do? Or what we think and stuff? How do you feel about that? Uh, I mean, it is democratic. Yes. I don't think Tsubasa would think... Uh, Kojimizu would be lacking in yeah. confidence, it's probably going to be one or three. He's either going to say it's a democratic thing, or he just sort of is just like shrug. <laughs> Pretty much, one or the other. Democratic, huh? Yeah. I guess if you're forming your own opinions, then that works, right? But for someone without that kind of confidence, like me, I just feel insecure. I'd rather he decide. I can I can uh, smell yeah. the lore wafting off you, boy. Yeah, it's just like how very lawful alignment yes, you the, are. Being familiar with the series, I can just smell the disinterest in free will protect he's gonna eventually go like Well let's just leave let's just leave everything up to the angels. Hmm. If confidence yeah. isn't exactly your strong point, then it helps to have someone with a plan. Someone like Master Abdiel. Whoops, sorry. I didn't mean to hold you up. Let's both be careful out there, yeah? As for me, I tend to be more free will myself. Yeah, generally. Just, I think that I would <laughs> probably be more on the chaos side of things, because I'm, I'm too uh, of the sort where I want people to freely, you know, it's, have agency yeah, over it's themselves. Generally in that. A common thing, at least in the from what we've observed, that the SMT fandom 
considers the law alignment one of the worst things in the series because it's just absurdly anti free will. Which is probably the probably yeah. the point, but also it's just no one ever, no one ever likes the heaven sides of the games. Which you can't really blame them. But at the same time it's funny because the chaos side's not actually better. But people like to ignore that part. That just means neutral is the best one. <laughs> why why have one or the other when you can be neither? But in this case, well, we'll find out whether Subasa is going to be really neutral or maybe it'll be chaos. Or maybe it'll be lore. God, I hope not. <laughs> we, we, it's, we'll just glare at, at him like, how dare you? How dare you be lawful? No. <laughs> But now you know, my, my current feeling is that we're going to be heading towards either neutral or chaos. That sounds about and right. even if chaos is not actually better despite what the fandom likes to think, it could still be worthwhile to at least get the chaos ending if we end up with it. And just see what becomes of it. Yeah. There's just going to be an entire area that's just... Oh boy. That's... That's a big abscess. What the heck? That's that sounded pretty robot-y. What do you want? The Karabia. Yeah, <laughs> cut that by half. <laughs> you'll, <laughs> you'll tell me for free. <laughs> oh, are those swords? Weird pull things? Could be. I'd say, like, from what we were able to see of anything, yeah, it's probably going to be devices of a similar sort of appearance, like those bobby spike things. <laughs> He'll tell me for free. Uh, thank you for actually uh, marking me. I... Absolutely. I love that you're just able to do that. Subasa is, is just like tired of, of people like constantly trying to like e exploit money out of him. He's just like, no. You'll tell me for free. Another section of basically running around doing E4 until the plot happens. Indeed, we kind of have our work cut out for us because we've got a lot to do. We can actually. Oh, hello. Oh, oh, hello there. <laughs> <laughs> Accidentally discover a meme on. <laughs> I love it when that happens, when you accidentally a meme on. Then again, that is like a pretty cheeky place to drop one in, too. It's funny because he was like, hold, Master said hold down after jumping. What does he mean? And what he means is advice for jumping better with controller. <sighs> Would be nice to get rid of that abscess at least, but not really sure. Best way around it and stuff. <laughs> oh, he's so up. Here's a question. How costly is your Mimon service going to be? This is the scam music, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> and then it just, so the music just slowly transitions into Tanaka's theme. <laughs> wow. 
Wow, wait, that would be an interesting mashup to do combine this and Tonica's theme. I mean, that's yeah, fine. It's really like a thing, I'm lazy. Just give me the... 15. Okay, that's a few, but not as bad as last time. Although we did pretty, pretty good clearing out this first area. And it's some there, and there, and so on, and... Yeah. It's just... That's definitely something I'll do off screen. Yeah. We can, the meme on hunting can happen later, yes. Well, there's the... The Epsis. And there's you. Oh! Wow! Hey, Demeter. Yeah. The Horn of Plenty. Or a Horn of Plenty. Ooh, I don't know, okay. the, a, either or. There's a Horn of Plenty. Possibly multiple. We're going to get at least one of them. I don't want a plenty. Held by a holy, holy... Held by a holy demon. So is it just going to randomly drop from a holy in me, or do I have to specifically find a holy race demon in the sea somewhere? I kind of want to say, and by kind of, I think it's what it's probably referring to is of the holy type. Hmm. So, any demons that we know of that have the tag holy is probably a viable target to potentially farm it off of them. We just come over and say, here you go, and hand over like three whole horn of plenties. I thought that there was only supposed to be one of them. Eh, keep the change. <laughs> 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 don't, don't question it, we, ha we have our methods. Okay. The the glowy power thing. Will you destroy this device? Yes. Ah, uh, so it's gonna be like you can fight her at any level you want. You just just take down as many pillars as you wish. Or as few as few as you wish. Like, okay, we could do that. I mean, we preferably would want to get rid of them all than a few of them. How much time have we been recording for? Because we could try to take on the abscess, we probably can get to it. Two, uh, two hours 15. Two hours 15. Ah, we could squeeze in tackling the abscess. How about that? Uh... I mean, the hope is, oh, you're, you, it's, it's, you're, 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 I wonder what the heck it could be weak to them. Oh, fire. Alright then. Also has a timing, but you know. Everything's weak that has a timing. Uh, usually. Mostly. You, you Usually <laughs> mostly. You'd have better, like... It'd be... A more expedient use of your time if you listed what it isn't effective against, rather than what it is effective against. Oh my god. Oh, rude. No, that's not fair. Not cool. Oh, please. Oh, you special with you. Well, it is weak to ceiling at least, so that's something. So it tells me that's probably what we're gonna have to do is keep it relatively sealed, especially yeah. when it's about to do a yeah. Magatsuhi thing. Or heal itself. Or heal itself. Because if, as long as it's allowed to Dirahan itself, we're gonna be here all day against this thing. Excellent. 
less excellent. But that's that's still good. Oh, I'm glad we, like, nullified all <laughs> those potentially dangerous spells that would have cast otherwise. Yeah. Alright, this turn should finish it off. Yep, there we go. Dead. Charge Dem Concentrate Gem. Yeah, that was an annoying one. Prayer of Vitality. Yeah, that makes sense. So what's Prayer of Vitality going to do? Oh, I see. It does a... Prayer of Vitality, War of Vitality, win the level up. Which is better than Vitality and Luck, but... Whether we want to spend glory on it is another question. Yeah, especially when we still have, like, extra skill slots we could buy and other <laughs> nice things like that. I just don't want to deal with kids and people who are not masked up and sick and shit and just... Uh, like, like, uh, cr hug, cry, I'm sorry. No, I, I understand, and it's, that is true, like, a lot of people are extroverted, and so they will literally, like, implode if they do not social. You know, no, yes, we're, we're back, we're back here again, we're finally back to, we had a bit of a break to go off screen, do things, and then things happened, and we just couldn't get back to this, so... But now we're back, we're done, let's progress. Yay, back. progress! Yeah, did all the off-screen things. Goalie, got all Excellent. the most of the, the pillory things. Got all the, most of the Miman. There's like one Miman missing and there's one pillar over here. Let's, let's creep those things. And then we will see what happens next. Heck off. They do need the heck right the heck off, don't they? Right, I did, I did change around skills a bit, so I've got Bufu dying now. Ooh, <laughs> interesting, okay. Uh, yeah. We got a nice little lineup of Bufadine, Zanma, Hamayan. Get some good stuff. We'd like to have had Zandine, but don't seem to have anything available in the shop essences. So, go just find some oh. sand on somewhere. Boo! Oh, we'll find it. Also, I wanted to like give Subasa a duo, but it's like locked off because we need to unlock the next tier of Essence Inheritance. Oh, well, uh. Damascus yeah. Claw. I mean, eh. neat, it, neat, but not for you. Oh, I see, we got some new things like Clotho and such. Oh, yes, that that's right. Yeah, I definitely don't remember these. <laughs> uh, ball of Ikea. Uh, hmm. Ter well, I guess that's not terribly useful. Mm -hmm. We could probably yeah, get rid of Retaliate, of, maybe. Kind of, but not, it's not going to do much. Especially with something with only 24 strength. Not terribly... I see, no, you're longer. Yep, oh yeah, we got... You're longer now. Excellent. Rainbow Snick. Great Mana Spring. Great Mana Spring. Greatly, uh, greatly increases max MP. This is tricky because it's gonna it's gonna go up to two eight eight rather than two two two. Hmm. But everything here is still really good. Maybe Diarahan because we've got we've got a healer. That's true. It is, yeah, so we could probably forego Diarahan. I mean, it's nice, but. You are, we already have keep, a healer, keep, as you keep said, so... Keep in case. Yeah. Oh, and a, and a noodle. We got noodle! Anyway, yeah, artery sensors. It's... Ah. Affects how Hello. many things you can actually select from the essences themselves, and currently we're locked off from the next set of things from the slots. Here we go. Oh, Desen there's an Endura. Desen there's an Endura, but it's locked off, so... Yeah, we need the next tier of that. Ah, from Addis, okay. We need the next okay. tier of that, and then we can get Endura onto Suasa. Which will be really useful, because, you know, it's Endura. <laughs> of course. Oh, Endura's great. And, I mean, who else but Subasa, right, would make the most use of it? 
Uh, I, I can almost guarantee that the moment we get the next slot to get into her, we'll then encounter like Cerberus, who I believe has a revival full HP on death, which would be really good because it'll be basically endure but better. So the game's just like, haha, you've got good this good thing. But here's a better thing that you can't get yet that we're gonna tease you with immediately. And it's just like cry. It's like I want this though. <laughs> Here's the last one. Will you destroy the device? We will destroy the device. Destroy it by making go zoop. Zoop. Alright, now that we've sapped all of her power spikes or something, pillars. <laughs> <laughs> now that we sapped them, we get to fight. Alright, it's fight time. Who stands before me this time? More of the jealous ones, crazed fanatics? I pity your blind acceptance. Do you not endeavor to see the truth for what it really is? In his eyes, all have fallen short of mercy. Pledge what faith you may, you will always be unworthy. He even thinks the Queen of Heaven beneath him. The arrogance. I am but one among the multitudes he spawned. And so, in the name of those your tyrant god has scorned, I shall wipe you from existence! No, you. But, wait, so... So... What? It, it sounded like she was mad about God, but she also is working for God? Make up your mind, lady. Yeah, I, I get a feeling there's a bit of confusion here, don't you? <laughs> Just a bit. <laughs> Feel my wrath! This turn is just like, what? My power? What have you done? Also, this is a very nice battle theme. <laughs> Oh yeah. Just gonna sit here vibing to it. <laughs> yep, that's exactly what I'm currently doing is vibing to it. And dark. Yeah, mostly thunder based. Hmm. Mostly thunder based with some light. Yeah, we'll do our usual. <laughs> oh, so kind of like a pseudo silence or seal, where it awesome. kind of did nothing. Hmm. So something tells me that if we didn't turn off all the pillars, she would have access to that, and it probably would be terrifying. <laughs> something tells me it probably is something like that. And now we can bring out the big stuff. <laughs> all right, this, all right, this time, are you ready for this? Are you ready? Are you ready for Hassel Toby? Let it begin. Oh yeah, uh, it, it was pretty good, but the feel was... We're hoping for something in this. 
Yeah. Like just cut okay. down like a few of the hills, but not quite that much. <laughs> it, the numbers made it feel impactful, but the amount that the health bar budge did not make it feel impactful is the thing. Not, not terribly. Not terribly. It's one of those weird moments where it looked like a lot of nothing happened. Okay, there we go. That was a good budge. Now we're getting somewhere. You're gonna be a pushover, aren't you? I feel like, yeah. I imagine if she had her powers still, she wouldn't be, but because we nerfed her, well, yeah. It helps that we have a lot of things to exploit weaknesses too, like she's already in the red, so. <laughs> Hasso Toby time! Ah, so many beautiful crits. Rude. Oh, thank goodness it didn't proc the insta-kill. I get a feeling that Hasatobi's crit, because it's it always does critical damage, it doesn't actually get the bonus damage from being critical hurt. Hmm. Or if it does get the bonus damage, it's actually its actual base damage is actually a lot lower to compensate for it. I think that's probably what it is. It's probably low base damage, it's just that it procs a lot, like eight times, so. Yeah, it's low base damage and always critical, so it, it, it helps to make stuff out. Yeah, it still makes it impactful though, like you, we've calculated it, it can do easily like in the thousands of damage. Yeah. So, Because the thing yeah. is, if you're going to program a a skill which did always did critical hits, you wouldn't want the base damage to be that high, otherwise it'll just always be more damage that you expect it to. True. Plus uh. you'd... You'd want to have a reason not to just spam it all the time, even <laughs> though we just love to spam it all the time, so. Because <laughs> it's just, it's that good, right? Alright, this will probably destroy it. Here we go. Oh, yes! <laughs> Beautiful, look at all those criticals, oh yeah. What a, what a push I can be to Bloomin' Lambrew. Oh my gosh, right? Barely even broke a sweat. Unless, of course, you're not the area boss. But M Maybe that's the real plot twist, is she's not me. actually the boss boss. But you were after the... We found the Miman, so I think you probably possibly are. Possibly, hmm. <sighs> I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to, but we understand why you would. True. Yeah, we're just that good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah if you've got friends that liked Ishtar, Go, go hide somewhere, because you did a boo-boo. Pretty much. Basically, Dekarabia is just like, oh no, I've done like the ultimate betrayal. Uh, I guess I'll just uh, be neutral over here and do nothing. Yes. I uh, <laughs> Don't pay attention to me, I don't exist. Goes from 252 to 327, which is pretty good. And using Zandine a few times in that, in that fight kind of did eat its MP, being a main nail train, well, it doesn't consume additional press two numbers. Which is pretty useful when you do a boo boo. It's, well, here's the thing, right? So it's good when you accidentally do an oopsie, but it's just insurance, is really all it is. Yeah. So we can forego safeguard because it's really just prevent failures or mistakes more than 
add to your effectiveness otherwise. At the same time as Kratos, he's 79 more MP is. It's also still just more MP. It's not it's not utility it's not utility as much as wasting less chakra drops. <laughs> Yeah, it really is. Like, that's the thing. It's It doesn't offer anything more. It's just you get to do your other things more. That's its thing. Because the more yeah. MP is just so good. Yeah, it is a, it is a it's good It's hard to say no. Because, like, like, the lesser mana spring, whatever it is, is like, it's okay. But the great one is like, ooh, yeah. that's the good stuff. Yeah, ooh, it's the unlocked profusion. There should be a Mimon around here somewhere. Uh, where are you? Down here. Yay, all of them. Oh yeah, 150 oh, for, 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 for this area, for so far. Can I... Probably can't. It, 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 it no. Hey, come on. Ah, how dare you. How dare I wanna indeed. I want to go exploring. Out of bounds. <laughs> and then they actually clip out and start falling through the geometry. I'm like, oh, oh no, oh no. It do be like that. I, I hope there's a kill plane down here, otherwise I'm going to be boned. Yeah, the the return pillar pop up only pops up if you're on the ground. So if you accidentally clipped through the ground or something, and there was no kill plane to walk you back out, you wouldn't be able to like cancel you, ju you just have to reset which would be a problem that, <laughs> that would definitely be a problem i i would like to avoid that issue i'm sure there's probably a kill plane it's probably like a standard thing in three games to make sure there's a emergency reset the player if they're falling through the ground state yeah, like some kind of reset where it's just like, if the game detects some certain thing happening, it's just like, here you go. We're just going to warp you back to the nearest valid terrain. <laughs> Not that. Or something. There has been plenty of games where they become memes because you'll fall through the ground and just keep falling. Gosh, yeah. Oh, you want to know something that's really dangerous too is, so you know how games calculate like, like falling and then you take like fall damage based on how long you fall, no matter how <laughs> far you actually fall? You can end up with really weird instances where if you fall very slowly down a cliff harmlessly, you're calculating fall time, and so by the time you actually <laughs> touch the ground really gently, it's just like bajillion damage, you're just like blah! It is very silly. I think I played a game like that where you would you could die to weird like deaths like that because you're gently sliding down a cliff. That seems the incorrect way to do it, yeah. I suppose I understand why you do it that way, like it'd be easier just to just calculate the time you've been spent in a fault state but you probably should actually calculate it in terms of distance like yeah remember the last altitude or y coordinates from from falling and if you hit a certain point that was greater than a certain number then just do the damage that way that feels like the better way to do it because yeah again don't do that approach it's very <laughs> silly <laughs> Yeah, and sometimes they just kill you if you're falling for a certain amount of time. Which also, it's dumb, but it's, it makes sense from like a... You're likely to die from this height. Let's just kill you now and save you the trouble. <laughs> exactly. It's like, you're just going to die, so here you go. And also prevents... Like, sequence breaking. If you're gonna like jump down a huge cliff to get to a certain area you shouldn't be, be at yet. That too. Things like that. Game dev stuff. <laughs> Game dev stuff. Yeah, it really just, just boils down to, like, just make something that makes sense, basically. TLDR. Anyway, speaking of things that make sense, what's this? Does it make sense? Maybe not. Oh, hello. Hi. It's you again. Oh, are we in trouble? Well. Uh. It That's seems a good your question. With I think we're going to find out. Was a success. 
Well done, boy. As the Archangel of Bethel, allow me to thank you for your assistance. All that remains is the castle, and the rightful execution of the fallen angel within. O oh, Lord on high, we vow to carry your order throughout this blighted, lightless land of chaos. Hark! Forces of Bethel! Wipe the demons of chaos clean from this earth! Push them back into the darkest depths of the abyss! I yep, mean, the plot thickens, basically. Our orders are to guard the castle entrance from demonic reinforcements. I mean, understandable, but also... Hmm... Hmm... <laughs> Yeah, hmm, indeed. We humbly request your aid in the infiltration of the castle, sir. Oh boy. Well, I guess, I guess, I guess we're helping them regardless of whether we want to or not. Basically. So it's one of those things where it's like, there's more than what seems to be, basically. There's, there's more going on. What do you want? Hmm, okay. Uh, sure? The Angel of Destruction? Sure. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Oh, there. That's where it is, okay. So, hmm. We just, like, go. Okay, let's go meet that angel. Now you must die because you're 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 on God's side and we're a we're a rebel. Yeah. Working working against people from the inside. Oh. <laughs> hmm. Wow. Oh, you actually do want me to Well fine, you could just stay there and sulk. <laughs> How dare you pull this trick on me again? I will not adhere to this. We all live in a capitalist society and we need to make our money somehow. Pr pretty much. <laughs> and Subasa is just, like, is just like, no, no, no you. No you, exactly. Uh, over here. Oh, look, things. Oh boy. Ooh, we sense yeah, the presence of a powerful demon. Yep, I'll take it. Let's see what happens. That must be the one we're looking for. Yes. Even confirmed. Yes! No. <laughs> Oh, thank you for completing our quest. <laughs> All right, Light Sutra. Yes, you you meet us. Good job. Uh, uh, wow. uh, okay. I was. Oh, I was gonna say. I feel like that should have been more. I don't know, involved <laughs> than just. Hey, you found us. Here you go. It's like. Uh, wait. You mean that's it? Yes. Uh, we're just gonna. Shrug at that. Indeed. Oh, well, okay. Ah, then, so here it is. Then, well, we we're, we were going to kill you anyway, but you're providing a, a, a substantial excuse as to the reason why we should kill you, because you, you, you struck first. Basically, it, it boiled down to just like, yep, so I disagree with you, so you die. <laughs> and it's like, oh, okay. Also, God is in the whole being up? Uh, apparently so. I mean, like, God is, God is dead, but s still, supposedly dead. Supposedly, unless we're the new God, yeah. apparently. Question mark. Okay. Or will be. We're on our road to it, anyway. 
so we want ice. Okay. So we're probably going to want to do a bit of trading out. These are beefed, these are beefed up, I think, aren't they? I think it was... They're, uh, they're special... They're like special boss plot angels, mm -hmm. but they're... They got specially higher stats just to be more of a pest. And they possibly won't die to Mito, despite that. That would be a very anticlimactic fight if that's all it ended up happening, was just like they all ended up being weak to Mudo, and you just sh one shot all of them. I would at least would have hoped that could have Mudoed the support, but. Well, good thing we had Bifty mm -hmm. die. Okay, that doesn't look this out too much health. <laughs> Freeze. How would you like some hassle? Hassle with Toby. Three of you, Isn't so it's, it? going to be, it's going to be a bit more tricky. Yeah, it just... Because the random, the random hits will target everything else. Yeah, so it goes from like a one target deleter to like, well, it's an AoE, sort of, in a way, yeah. Oh, don't be doing that. No. Cease the healing. We're about to use... Actually, we could use physical. Supposing it's... More likely to use... All hit, all, all attack. Yeah, all hits than one hit. Can we kill it in this turn? Probably not. Yeah, no. We could... No. I don't think the gamble will be worth. What we can definitely do is mess up the mess up the boss a fair bit. No, do not. <laughs> I know, right? Like uh, sad. I will smite you. Ugh, that was spicy. No. Yeah, no. I mean I'm I'm glad that Surinup can resist that, but also please no. Wow, they really hated Surinup, jeez. Yoshitsune is having none of that. Here. Time for Clotho. So it shall be. Do not. 
Yeah, they need to, like, stop that. In it. Oh my god, again? Uh, again. Let's go! What should use physical this time? So that would be rude. I imagine it would be though. Okay. No. Okay. It just likes to use fire. matter. These aren't that hard. Yep, now it's just the fun cleanup part. <laughs> yeah, a little bit, a little bit of a worry, worrying moment, but otherwise it wasn't too bad. At least they put up a better fight than Ishtar then. I mean, needs, but we're not sure Subasa would. Subasa would use it as long as it was useful, and then be like, okay, please stop worshipping me, this is creepy and confusing. Yeah, he'd have a very strictly, I think, utilitarian approach to it. He'd use it for a goal or some other, like, t to further, like, an agenda or, or something of the sort. But he wouldn't just do it just because he's like, hee hee, I want people to worship me. That He'd just think, like, dude, that's creepy. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> uh. If anyone's going to be like, he he worship me, it would be drawing for a little bit, a little bit longer, and then draw would also be like, okay, this is this is actually getting weird. Please stop. In order of people who would take glee in a some kind of worship play, it would be Juro, Joram, and then Subasa. And that sounds about right. Takahiro would be at the bottom, and be like absolutely not. Takahiro would be the least interested. I I think so. Yeah. Only with Yukiko. King. <laughs> <laughs> he he would allow it with Yukiko, yeah. Play around with friends. Anyone else is off limits. And even then, maybe he'd just do it just for like the like ironic part, maybe. Because you know he's he's a bit of like a silly jokester so, like type. So. And Juro being the big show off would take absolute glee in it. Up until it starts getting too serious. Joram would be amused about it by it for a while because you know even if he grows past his social links for power character arc he still would fall into it sometimes and of course as we just said Subasa would be like utilitarian about it until it starts being too far and then he'd go nope but yeah I agree with that as long as like in Jero's case if it remained like a like a light-hearted fun kind of thing he would yeah. he would revel in it 
Yeah. <laughs> Creating all this weird backstory for our Atlas silent protagonist OCs. Ah, uh, isn't it wonderful? Like, we have this whole, like, head cannon that's, you know, our own cannon, not like head <laughs> cannon made for the actual characters, because yes. I'm pretty sure this is completely wrong for all of them, but yeah. For our OC versions, the, the you know, <laughs> do, original character do not steal versions. Like, when you have Sonic character OCs that are like 15% different at most, <laughs> like a different shade of blue and like different style of sneakers and maybe like, I don't know, like chartreuse eyes and, as opposed to like emerald green and it's just like this is my this is my character uh sound wave the hedgehog uh do not steal <laughs> uh, oh my god now let's let's progress see what happens and then ends for now sounds good and we can enjoy our, our silly ramblings as we do so this is the Demon King's castle. Young man, the Archangel has already sent a team of troops ahead. We should take care not to let them get too far. Castle first stratum. Oh uh, boy, is this, is this an actual dungeon, is it? I think this is an actual dungeon dungeon. This could definitely be a off-screen thing. If, if, I, we can, if we can get enough done between this and next session, we'll find out. We ended up cutting, managed to cutting it down, the, the episode down to like just an hour, which is quite impressive. Yeah, like that's it's, very it's, compact. It's possible that there was a lot of stuff I could have kept in, but yeah, it was almost felt like it wasn't terribly eventful last session. But yeah, we got, we got to, we got Ishtar bait easily, and we beat up an angel. And also we got to a new area and a new area new, a, new, a new new area yep a new new area newer than the last the newest area currently and this seems like a good spot to stop doing the off-screen things again assuming there's no random plot literally around the corner just to be in the way and annoying there's no there's no like destination marker so presumably there's no like major Cutscene's gonna happen as I explore a dungeon, a dungeony bit to go through. Good, th good things to get done off screen, and then we can come back and do more plotty things, or more entertaining grindy things. Ed, no, go away. Don't care. Ed, no, don't care. You know, you know, like yeah, we we try to be entertaining, even with the random nonsense in between. When we start start talking endlessly about our OCs. Or critiquing the education system. Or coming up with really wacky, silly things like our comparison of our OCs to like uh, slightly different Sonic OCs <laughs> or something. We don't know how they to be entertaining, so we just kind of wing it. I, yeah, I sure as heck just kind of <laughs> do a thing and things and stuff and I don't know. Things uh, and stuff, basically. Two Toys played SP5. That was the thing. Episode 10. As a Episode 10. Wahaha. Oh we're God. now at the big two digit mark. Oh God, I can't believe we're at two digits. <laughs> it, it, it is a thing, though. And we've been pretty consistent as of late for the past, like, three ish episodes, I think. Might have a minor hiccup with getting more of this episode done, but, you know. Even if we had to, like, break up recording sessions, at least we're getting it done on a timely basis. <laughs> but yeah, thank cool. you for joining us. Yeah, on this wonderful adventure. Yeah, you know, join us, we suppose, if you want to or not. <laughs> join us next time if you want to or don't. You know, it's it's entirely your call. <laughs> the will of the Lord demands you watch our Let's Play. We will, we will take you to the toy box and demand you play with us. Or else you will squeak. Well, you'll squeak either way. That's, that is true. You will squeak <laughs> either way. It's just a matter whether you do it willingly or through thorough convincing. And then we'll stick, we'll stick you, plonk you down in front of the TV with a controller and you will play with us. That, that, I, I, I don't know. <laughs> Words, things. How, however, towards Let's Play, as, as we've established once and time and time again, words is hard. Words is hard. Squeak instead. <laughs>